Fitting a customer to the correct grip size is an overlooked element in the fitting process. The videos that follow will provide you with detailed steps that will guide you through the process of properly fitting a customer to the correct grip size, as well as procedures for installing grips to achieve different grip sizes. If possible, have the customer grip one of their existing clubs. Have them grip it normally with their upper hand only in the address position. Look at the tips of their middle two fingers. If these fingers are digging into their palm, the grip is too small. If there is a gap, one eighth inch or more, between the tips of the two middle fingers and the palm, the grip is too big. On a grip that is correctly sized, their fingertips will barely touch the heel or the palm of their hand. To give you a measurable starting point, measure their existing grip at the two inch position down from the butt end of the grip using the universal grip gauge. To determine the correct grip size, use the grip size samples provided. The grip size samples are numbered 1 through 5, with each number corresponding to a different size. Based on the information obtained from the customer's current clubs, have them take their grip in the playing position with a sample grip that you determine would be a good starting point to dial in the correct size. Examine their fingertip position related to the heel portion of the palm of their left hand. For right-handed players, right hand for left-handed players. Repeat the process as necessary with the different grip samples until you determine what size best fits the player. Once the correct grip size is determined, it is important to verify with the player that the grip size chosen feels good to them. In some cases, the player's feel preference can override the correct measured size. The goal is to have the player comfortable with the size chosen so that it allows them to grip the club with the proper grip pressure, which is the key to the grip's contribution to performance.